This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. For Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. My name is D Reader, the Million Dollar Terror. For those of you that are new, and welcome to the Million Dollar Channel. This is my Sagittarius' past love message. You, this might not even be a past lover for you. You could be dealing with this person currently. Maybe I'll just start speaking at the moment. You know, take what energy resonates, of course, and leave what doesn't for someone else. We have, I couldn't let you get close to me. This is a Gemini or an Aquarius. I know I'll cross that line with you. I don't react when people mention you. I feel you even though we are apart. You speak to me through music. I can't stop thinking about you. This could be a Pisces for some of you. This could be an Aries. I will wait for a sign from you. I feel you leaving me behind. My life is not together as it seems. Just being near you was intoxicating. Finding out the truth crushed me. You and I were too young. I replay our conversations over and over. I wish I could share my good news with you. You were the best thing in my life. I lost myself for a while. This person feels like in the midst of y'all disconnecting they lost everything they lost you they lost some of them they lost their jobs I'm, I'm getting things got pretty bad some of them even lost their house apartment car whatever shit got really bad for this person Sagittarius and I'm getting you seen it coming too when you try to even help them I hear who I really am from you I want to be more than friends I'm so attracted to you you friends on this person you seen that they weren't the one or at least you felt that way at that time I left when I saw you with someone. Okay, so for some of you, they walked away from you. Maybe because they seen that you were interested in someone else. And now they have, they are not available. So, I don't know. This could have been a third party energy on your end or theirs. You know, take what energy resonates to leave what doesn't for someone else, of course. So many things remind me of you. We need to let each other go. I want to feel that way again. We will be together again. Okay, so for a lot of my sages. There is a moment coming up where you're going to actually reconcile, possibly. This is if you're wanting it, too. They're wanting it, but they don't know if you want it, which is why you haven't heard from them, and which is why they haven't even brought these feelings to your attention. I'm getting this person, for some of you, has never even expressed these thoughts to you. Like, you didn't even know this person felt this way. I hide, I hide behind material things. I love you unconditionally. This could be a Libra for a lot of you. I knew exactly what I was doing. This is for those of you that are wondering if they meant to do what they did. I mean, as far as like crossing lines, unfortunately they did. They didn't realize what the outcome was going to be. They more was just thinking off the thrive of the moment. And now they're kind of dealing with the consequences because Sagittarius wants nothing to do with them now. Sagittarius wants no part. Sagittarius doesn't care anymore. This could be an Aries for some of you. We got some Aries energy here. This could be a Taurus. You could have a history with one of these signs. You could be currently dealing with one right now, but I'm really getting this as a history for a lot of you. This person is wanting to come back. This Aries. We got a lot of Aries energy showing up. They are wanting to come back in there. They have a Knight of Cups energy. Like they're swearing that they're gonna like change their ways. They're gonna have their heart on their sleeve this time. You're very close to achieving a goal. For those of you that are on a spiritual or mental journey right now, you're very close to achieving that goal, but there's an energy that you need to release. I don't know if this is Aries energy or this Taurus energy. For those of you that have a history with one of these signs and still holding on to things, but the universe is wanting you to release that energy right now. This could be a Leo for some of you. Somebody has a history with a Leo, a lot of fire energy showing up. Don't let your pride get in the way. So that's some Libra energy. Somebody could be dealing with a Libra. A win-win outcome is forecast, believing the impossible. Somebody has a history with a Cancer or a Libra. Some of you are still dealing with a Cancer or a Libra right now. You just might not be speaking at the moment. I'm seeing that somebody's trying to get through an insecurity right now. I don't know if this is you. This could be this Libra, this Cancer. A personal issue reaches resolution. Emotions are running high. So for a lot of you, your emotions could be running really high when it comes to a Cancer. For a lot of my Sagittarius is right now, your emotions could be running extremely high when it comes to a Cancer. This cancer has put you through the woodworks, or you could have put this cancer through it. I'm getting both of y'all are putting each other through, you know, the wind. The energy is gaining momentum for those of you that do have a history, but I'm seeing that this is like a situation ship. It always has been like nothing is really set in stone. Some of you have a history with a Virgo. A lot of you were wondering if you were good enough for this Virgo. 
this Virgo could have been wondering if they were good enough for you as well. Looks like a lot of you have an Aquarius coming in. Somebody could have a history with an Aquarius as well. We got to show the world the real you. So the universe is wanting you to show a side of you that you haven't ever really shown. I am still doing five for five questions for Sagittarius. The cash app is D-E-E-F-O-N-D-E-L. The email is gmail.com. You can check out the description below for more. Thank you.